Welcome to Modern Homestead Alaska. We are at the wildest Costco that we have never been to. It is the home showroom. There's very few of these, but what we should be able to experience in this Costco is all of the things, appliances and no furniture. Idea. We have no idea. Let's head in and find out what they got. Is that like gold? I don't wanna say that, it's like a gray. What? What does that one do? Or is it just showing you the different finishes? No. You can oh, it's see-through? See yeah. Oh, do that. And it has two doors. Ooh. Yeah. $2,900. Holy cow. Why do you need to open it from the back and the front? Literally. I think we need this. Only 4000 bucks. What? And it's just a grill. The amount of outdoor cooking you can do three months of the year? This is like half your freezer side. This is the freezer side. This is your fridge side. Oh, so it's a... It's tiny. Holy. So, to be able to go online in Costco, anything online we can order it and it would ship as well. Um, but it's nice to actually be able to see these things in person and not just try and do them online. I have a freezer, I'll see if they have it, that I get a lot of questions about. My mom needs a new wood shed. This, $799, mom. You could use that. Have you found the deep freezes? Why would... It's so weird. Oh, that's tiny. Look at the inside of this one. That is such a little refrigerator. For two grand? Oh, 2,500? Sheesh. I think this is, this is fridge too. You think it's a oh it's no, I see is. people on TikTok like load these with yeah, like they're, their snacks. snacks and stuff snacks and then this is your freezer yeah but that is it's the same I space. like the organization however it just takes up so much space as well look at that only four thousand three hundred ninety oh that's you. <laughs> Is this a wine fridge? <gasps> oh yeah. my! Yeah. If you only have room for a refrigerator, but you really, really wanted a wine fridge, Costco has you covered for only four thousand dollars. Or, I have no room for this, but. Look at this fine fridge. $999. Oh my. I see some more down there. None of these are the freezer. The freezer that I have has all drawers. And I think it is amazing. It holds our fruits and vegetables. I wonder. Oh, this is it. I found it. So the whole thing is drawers, and then I'm able to organize like a broccoli in one, and corn, or peas, green beans, fruit, and so on. And it does work really, really well. Three hundred and $99. So I have one of those and I think they're amazing. This Samsung freezer, $6.99 if you wanted it, it's a lot bigger. 11.4 cubic feet. Okay, so it's only 0.4 cubic feet bigger. However, it is drawers on the bottom and then some shelves. Maybe you could do like frozen pizzas or something like that up there. And then a couple of doors rack so little different design but it's over double the price so six 
$4.99 versus $3.99 for that one. So when we moved into the house, Caleb got two sets, um, a couch and a love seat. And he took the one that was in the basement and Cody took the one that was in the upstairs family room. So we currently have no furniture, but we have a bunch of family coming for Christmas. And so Aaron and I have been looking for the dream couch. We're not gonna get anything today, but I'm looking for like a U-shaped couch with ottomans that would turn it into like a giant bed. And then we also need a smart TV because we cannot get normal TV where we're at, but we are able to get internet and then a smart TV, you don't have a TV package where you're paying for all that. You're just paying for the internet, um, which is the, what's the Elon Musk internet we have? Starbee, Starlink, oh Star, we have something. <laughs> so let's go look at the furniture. Like, I, I don't know like why I like the rattan look coming back. $700 for that chair. Sit in it. Tell me if it's cozy. It, I don't like it this is one. really pretty. I don't think so. I like the vintage style of it. It's pretty nice. It's just ugly. It's pretty nice. It's just ugly. <laughs> I love this color. I like the gold legs. All of that is coming back, I guess. No? I'm sitting on a balloon. <laughs> what do you think? I like the blue. Yeah, it's just like weird. it really would open up the room, don't you think? I see no balance. It is such a vintage look. It's alright. No? Is that the one? I ripped all the lining out of the gray chair. It is so bad, but Dad needs a new chair in the living room. Oh, it rocks. Kick up the legs. How comfy is it? Four ninety nine. Not bad, huh? Yeah. What about this brown one? No, that's for no? rocks. You don't like it? I already tried it. Our mattresses are way more, but it's nice. You can get one for five hundred ninety nine dollars. That's the cheapest mattress. Are we serious about the vintage though? Like the look of this dresser? And then this one? I am so confused as to where style is going or back to. Weston. All right, we made it over to the couches. Maybe. <laughs> Cody, what are you gonna do with it? I'm not buying one. I told him 50 bucks and he said 350. No way! What would you do with that? Oh, this is nice. Scoot the ottoman in. This is along the lines of what we're looking for. Put your feet up, I'll scoot it in. Not a bad idea. I wonder if it'd be uncomfortable to sleep on. Yeah, 100%. Oh, that's a beautiful couch. That's very classy, don't you think? Please remove shoes. Ah, I'm alright. $3,499. It's a seven bed. piece. What? It's like a bed. We have nothing upstairs. <laughs> <laughs> it's brown. I just feel like this gives single dad vibe. Single dad vibe. <laughs> oh, I'm so serious. You s it's a single man's couch? Yeah. Yeah? Oh. Cody, check out this one. It's like giant amounts of pillows. That's not cozy, is it? You feel it's like it's not uncomfortable, but it feels like you would 
struggle to get in and out of it. Like, yeah. like a bean bag? It is a little... It is a little cozy. <laughs> How much is this set? 23. That's not light brown, that's literally gray. Is this the wrong sticker? Yeah, it's a brown gray color, oh. huh? Well, that would become like a bed. That one's so terrible. firm. Oh, but look, it lifts up. Yeah. This was the other thing we were talking about is the storage. Yeah, and this turns into so a bed. So you can put all of the... Does it not? Oh. This is, is it comfy? No. Two oh, hands. Different. Works as a couch, right? Yeah. yeah. As a bed. Have you seen the other one that took this Yeah, yellow. Now, just keep it this right here is a display model. That's why, you know, it's a little, it's a little dirty, a little yeah. grimy. We're so, Alaskans. So what you want to do, you want to go and pull this down. Slide these down forward. And it's very simple. With one hand, you come right here down the middle. You just pick it up and it folds out into the bed. Where it's designed where you can use it as your pillows. And you can put a bed sheet on it as well. What, what? size bed does this make? It's more like a full size. A full? Yeah, ah. more like a full How size. How much is this one? $17.99? Now, with that being said, this will have some shipping and handling. In case you need a safe, they have those. They have a magic toilet for only $1,799. Don't use the floor model. Is that a composting toilet? Clean up on aisle nine. <laughs> A smart toilet. Huh. Hurt. Nice. Thirteen hundred dollars. I mean, you could put a gym, home gym, in. Eighteen hundred ninety-nine dollars sauna. Why it asked me for one of these? Just so Alaska winter, you can warm yourself to the bone. You can do that here for only eighteen hundred and ninety-nine dollars. I think it's all electric too, so you can do this inside. Okay, so how many of these showroom Costco's are there nationwide? So nationwide, we are looking at two. So the first one's gonna be in Puerto Rico. That was the original one that opened about two years ago, two and a half years ago. So our store opened up on April 12th. So we nice. are the second one in the country. So the third one, it's gonna be in Hawaii, I Pearl City, it. coming to you in October. Which island? Uh, Oahu. Oahu, there you go. So we are super special in Alaska. Very, very so special. We are actually United States, so Puerto Rico yes, is a, a territory of a the territory. United territory. So we are yes. the only state in the entire United States per se. with a showroom. Per se, yes. There we go. Privilege. <laughs> we are privileged. Well, it was right. beautiful and the service was fantastic. Excellent. Thank I appreciate you guys. That. No problem. We appreciate Thank you for coming you. in. And if you do like what you see, make sure you go to Costco.com or Costco app and do all your shopping. Thank you very much. Thank you. So much fun. They were so kind to us. And the wildest part is right there is another Costco. And I, apparently there's five Costcos. So there's the two regular Costcos that everyone has. This, the home showroom, the business center, which has become my favorite Costco. And they have a logistics Costco. So it's not open to the public, but it deals with all of their internal shipping and all of the craziness so cody and i are going to head over to this costco right here that i never take you guys in because i don't shop at it very often but we're clear on this side of town we might as well oh halloween Ooh. howie <laughs> Don't do Halloween at our house. I just have never loved it, but that was so funny. But they have, if you do, and decorate for Halloween. Look at these. What are they? I think they're snow globes. They're lanterns, it says. Oh. Oh, shake it. Or does it's it? It's heavy as heck. Oh, so it does it on its own? Yeah. Gotcha. Maybe we should. <laughs> It has little flying bats. Uh, $69, $89.99, now it's $6999. Uh, let's see if they have any false stuff. I wanted to buy you a rug. 
That's cute. If I did Halloween, I would do this. Look at the little Mickey pumpkins. Seasonal? Nope. Rugs? No, they're all Halloween. No. There is candy. We could get it on sale. No, they sell it at Party City for week. They do? So, $22. I have two neighbors that have little kids and I do buy candy every year for Halloween and then I give them to all my little neighbor kids and I let them put in an order saying whether they want gummy candies or chocolate, but they already have all of that out here at Costco. Nice. Look at the size of this freeze dryer. $15.99 it says. Only $1,600 for this tiny, tiny Home Pro freeze dryer. Oh, it comes with the whole kit. I have all of these pieces. That is itty bitty. I did not know that Harvest Right made freeze dryers this small. It's a lot of money still, $1,599, but for the single family home or the double family, I have the largest size freeze dryer that they made at the time that I got it. But this little tiny thing for $1,599, this is what you seal the Mylar bags with. This is the pump, the oil pump, and then it comes with all of the different parts and pieces but this is so small if it really is something that you're like i could never fill a large size freeze dryer it might be worth actually looking into so i'm just a little blown away i would never buy it because <laughs> of the size of our family but i think things are adorable when they are cute and small and then i would assume this still has all of the harvest right warranties and support and the whole nine yards but if you were interested there we have it how bizarre i got my vacuum at this costco Ooh, 3.99 oh that's the bigger one and red i think a lot that, more for years than i paid for this really my new red mixer you see in my kitchen, um, Cody got that for me for Christmas. And then the white one that I had is sort of on its last leg. No, we didn't mean it offensively to her, but I gave it to her for her new home. So she has one as well. This is the vacuum I have. I absolutely love it for $189. And I was hoping that maybe they sold the filters to it does not look like they do. This is the food saver I have. It has the attachments so you can do like jars and stuff like that. Only $99.99. So for a hundred bucks I use this just as often as I use the chamber vac because it's just so much easier to dig out in the kitchen. For a hundred bucks it's it's a fairly good deal. Nice. Cody, this is really pretty. This eight piece kitchen tool set and this cream, $14.99. Are you buying? No. All right. But I think it's really pretty. Oh, look at the reusable bags. 14 piece reusable storage bags for $12.99. That's nice. Oh, it's got little mushrooms on it. Cute. These are adorable for storage. Or I saw someone recently was using all of these um, for their produce. So they pre-do the produce and they were packing like salads and stuff in these little sealable jars. That is super, it's a cute idea for $14.99, uh, four piece jar set. So normally $19.99, $5 off. Did you buy bath towels? Nice. What color? Brown. Brown. These are super nice. 
$6.99 at the business center. They're not this nice, I don't think. Um, I only buy white so that I can bleach them. <laughs> but, oh, I have several little sets of these sheets. They don't hold up super well, but for $19.99, they're actually super soft. 20 bucks. Okay, those of you that live in Anchorage, does this Costco have a more than the one across town? What one are we at? The south side one? We're diamond? At, the, diamond. We're at the Diamond the one. Costco. These are way more expensive at the Home Depot. So these LED outside string lights are $29.99. This is what I have in my chicken coop. Oh look, astronaut. Costumes, $32.99 and $29.99. Look, look at the little fireman. So cute. Oh, little army men. I don't know what that is. They, they don't have a lot. That doesn't mean that they won't restock them. So I would say if you're looking to do costumes, you might want to get them a little bit early. Lots of princess, a mermaid. Frozen, I guess. Let's see. Jasmine. Frozen. Golf? Right. Is it actually plugged in and working? Oh, you lost? <laughs> Golf number two. Pull back. Push then push forward. Yeah, the stroke penalty for what? Uh-oh. <laughs> right in the freaking water. This thing got mad. Oh, Pac-Man for only 219 dollars. Nice! If you had a kid that was into that, you could get that early for Christmas, huh? Oh, shit. Ah! I <laughs> you died. This costume is a complete madhouse, but I think it has, it must be bigger square footage than ours. Otherwise, it has a lot more in the way of like clothing, and different stuff like that. We are pausing our shopping for just a minute. Cody and I realized neither one of us have ate anything today. So we're gonna run in and just have some soup and salad for lunch. And then we will continue on our all the Costco's shopping trip here in Anchorage, Alaska. We live in Alaska. Of course it's raining. Let's go to the third Costco. All right, we're at the Dunbar. Is that the name of this room? Yeah. The Dunbar Costco. This was my favorite Costco until we got the business center. This one is my most shopped. For some reason, it's a little less busy and the parking's a little bit simpler than the other one. Let's head in and see if there's anything different in this one. Where is all of the, there's no Halloween stuff at the entrance. Totally different. Oh, here. I have a very serious question for you guys. I just showed you this freezer at the other Costco for $399. And look, it's $299 at this one. This is the freezer I have with all the drawers. $299 at the other Costco. That is so strange, just across town. Okay. Second immediate thing, the other one was full of Halloween stuff. Christmas wrapping paper, $14.99. Why is there already wrapping paper out? We have not, we haven't even had fall. Although, some of the colors are fantastic. You could totally use this for Christmas. Or birthdays, spring, holidays. That's really beautiful. Three rolls, 270 square feet, 
$14.99. It literally has Christmas out. Holiday mini. Where are we at here? Dizzy, $54.99. Holiday glass trees. Okay, these big beautiful glass trees. $69.99. The Grinch. He's cute. $53.99. Squishmallows. Mmm. Mm. Chocolate covered almonds. Look at here. Ribbon. This would match my Christmas. Gnomes. Computer those. Eight forty nine for fifty yards. We have Christmas lights that you can control the colors from your phone. I think things are getting just way too technical. I just like the good old fashioned lights. Oh! A Christmas story. Board game. $29.99. Elf. Mm -hmm. This is how. Oh, it's an advent calendar. Feels like we got a little time before then. Oh, a Halloween house. Chocolate cookies. $12.99. We've got hand warmers back in stock. And feet warmers. They always sell out of these in the winter time up here. $14.99. The hand warmers are $13.99. 16 bucks. The material feels nice. Yeah, those are cute. Oh, fuzzy socks. $9.99. Can get your underwear here at Costco. I do need to put something actually in the cart. These grain-free dental chews. We give Roberto and Tipper one of these every day and they absolutely love them. So there's a 72 count for $27.89. What is that? That's a dot waterproof pet blanket furniture protector. I do need this for Tipper. Yeah. Oh my gosh, $17.99. Yeah, grab me one of those. When we were doing the decorating for fall, I showed you how badly we've torn up a blanket that is on the couch because our dog Tipper gets on the couch all the time. And this is really, it's very heavy duty and it might stick to the fabric a little better. And it's nice and soft. So I will try covering the couch with this and see if we can use that instead of the blanket that's totally falling apart. Sometimes things are strange. Cody is doing her own meal prep as well and the whole purpose of her and I shopping today is we are doing a huge freezer meal tomorrow where we make several different bowls, the food prep and all of that and we are getting all of the supplies for that. And Cody's stuff, she needed the peppers She's gonna chop them and eat them. So for $9.99, she can get the six pack of peppers, which ultimately is cheaper than these little miniature bell ones, which are $7.99. But sometimes it's hard to tell because they'll sell per each. So each pepper is $1.66, whereas this is $5.32 a pound. And so sometimes figuring out the math on what is the best and cheapest way to go is not as easy as one would think. We're grabbing some burger. So we have the organic 620 
five a pound, or you can do this Costco at four ninety nine a pound. Ooh, guess what's back? The giant pumpkin pies for five ninety nine. That's a banana cream pie for fifteen ninety nine. Caleb would just. I think he would eat the whole thing yeah. by himself. Where's the apple pie? My son Caleb, his favorite pie is banana. Well, it's pecan, but a banana cream pie, he would kill for. Then $5.99 for these giant pumpkin pies. And they're actually not bad at all. I don't think they're bad at all. I don't know. $22.29. This is a chicken pot pie that you bake at home. The only thought is... I have never made freezer chicken pot pies. I might add that to the freezer meals. So the theme of the freezer meals is going to be rice bowls. So we're doing a non chicken is our goal. We are doing a green chili and then we are doing like an Asian style one. And we have some non, but we thought if we get these, we can freeze them with the non and they would fit in the freezers. For $6.89. So I just found these, these tiki kebab skewers. There's 12 skewers, 24 grams of protein. They are, where's the price? $28.79. You can buy how many pounds of chicken is this? Fine. So we got so making the Indian chicken ourselves. So um, $28.79, that's two pounds versus what? We said nine pounds for this nearly the same exact price. Um, by doing the freezer meals ourselves, the amount of money that we will save, not only for Aaron and I, but the other families and kids as we come together and build this as a team. The last time my mom and I came together, we got this sheet pan vegetables right here. They are $12.99 and they have a blend of Brussels sprouts, sweet potatoes, broccoli, red onions, and zucchini. And it is one of the best frozen mixed vegetables that I have done. So we've gotten those instead of the Asian pack of vegetables to do in our Asian chicken. $12.99 if I didn't already say that. Let me see if they have anything else around here. All right, we're going to look for one more thing at this Costco and that is green chilies. And if not, we have a couple more stops to make. Um, and then we have one more Costco and you're done for the day. We are at our final Costco, the business center which is closest to Cody's house. Yeah. So after we do a quick shop through this Costco, we're going to be able to just drop her off back at home. And tomorrow we'll be doing our freezer mill workshop. It is hunting season. We have the grinders right off the bat, but the one thing I've never seen, oh, I've heard these are really good. These sealers, the vacuum sealers. Let's see, $399, but look over there. Look at this meat. It's like a slicer blade thing. Tabletop meat saw, $689. In case we start processing our own huge animals, right? Just in case you do not want the yellow lids with the black totes, they switched to turquoise. How cute are these? So storage totes, $12.99, but you can either get the yellow right over there or the turquoise lids. If I all of a sudden switch, you know, it's because the turquoise is way cuter than the yellow. I hadn't seen that. Had you seen that yet? No. Cody hadn't seen that yet before either. Let's see what else is new. We actually have a shopping list and this has been an all day affair. This Costco is super cool because it has so many individual package things. For resale, they're also pretty fantastic when you take them places. So all sorts of craziness in here. 
so quiet. Quiet. Look at these. I love these abuelas. What is it? It's a Mexican hot chocolate thing. It's so good. Oh, apple cider is back for fall. $7.99. Box of it. They have these professional biscuit mixes, 25 pound boxes. That's what you're getting at the restaurant for $24.99. Look at the high gluten flour, almond meal. All of this is normal. This is my favorite Costco flour. Um, Organic, two 10 pounds for $17.89. Oh, that's watermelon. Oh, $9.99. I thought that was the tomatoes. Never mind. $34.49. We are honestly so tired. I hope that you guys aren't tired. Um, we're still looking for green chilies. There's red peppers, 14. What did you pay, nine? These are two dollars a pound. Oh, the serranos, jalapenos. Fresh out of luck, sister. Ugh. All right, so frustrating. Oh, tomatillos, eight ninety nine a bag. Two bucks a pound. Look, they have regular size coffee creamers. For three dollars. The bad kind. Chocolate milk. Ooh. Dogs. <laughs> A loaf around. This is cheaper than the stuff I just bought. Nice. All right. So I kept talking about. So these are these food storage containers with lids, 150 count, $32.99. So this is like the same size that you can buy the frozen ones in. But then Cody said to me, you actually bought this one already, right? Yeah, I got this at home. So the 38 ounce is a little bit bigger, but I think it's going to work. $37.99. She already owns these, so we're gonna use what we have and not buy. And so now, actually, I have nothing in the cart. This is Cody's. She's got some cleaner. She's making homemade granola bars and needed a cereal to go in it. What are you doing with the cream cheese? Uh, cream cheese pumpkin cookies. Cream cheese pumpkin cookies. What are you doing with the gushers? Oh, snack. <laughs> and then this is for the dogs. I'm gonna get myself something, spoil myself. I like these flavored waters. I haven't had them since this summer. And they're $21 for four. Um, so it's less than a dollar a can, which my Red Bull addiction was way more money than this. So I think this flavor is awesome. Oh. Where's the trick at? Right there. <laughs> it's right over All there. Alright, right, ready? My keys are in my pocket so it'll automatically unlock. Woo! How is the sun shining? And it's raining. Of course it's raining. It's always right here. That's why it's so green and beautiful. We are finished. Let me get in the truck. We'll talk in a second. I'll wish you a well. We got home from Costco last night and I thought I would show you everything that we got. The goal was to get as little as possible for the freezer meals that we're going to be making. And I think we pretty much accomplished that. So everything that I got was some fresh flowers. I just like having them. I think they make the kitchen look beautiful. And after doing all of the decorating and those sort of things, I think it's wonderful to have something fresh and alive going on in the kitchen. I got the dog 
blanket that we want to put on the couch because the dogs get on there. We got the naan that we plan on adding to the Indian chicken and being able to just freeze that along. When you heat up the rice and the chicken, you'll just pull the naan out and then throw it in for a few seconds afterwards. But having these little ones we thought would be great in there. We went ahead and got some chicken breast. I'm almost out of just the chicken breast. I still have some whole chickens that we raised, but we went ahead and grabbed some of this. We grabbed some ground beef. We looked and looked and looked for green chilies. We found some green chili, like the sauce um, or gravy type green chili that was already pre-made. And that is not what we were looking for. So we may have to change directions a little. We did grab the ground beef. I'm sorry. The camera is being stacked into. We got the sheet pan, the veggies, the drinks, and then the dog dental chews. I already gave them some of those out of the box. And our grand total for the week was $131. But things got a little bit crazy, and that is how this end, this video is going to end. Let me show you. <laughs> Look! Within an hour of Cody and I having a conversation and thinking that Aaron needed his own hunting dog and that we would look for one. Cody and her brothers had this thing on the way within an hour. Um, so we got him from a really good home and Aaron hasn't even seen him yet. He hasn't been home. He does not know. And so here in just a few minutes, Aaron's on his way home now he's gonna get to see his gift that I got to cuddle with all night long. Say hi, say hi. Aaron's on the dirt. Look at his little bow. He is the same as Blue. <laughs> he's an English Springer Spaniel. He does have the doxed tail and his dew claws and he is a purebred huh and he is this precious blue ruined us he totally ruined us on dogs and aaron really really wanted his own hunting dog and the best thing for blue right now those of you that are new around here just finding us blue is our technically our daughter's english springer and he just turned a year old and Cody doesn't live at home anymore. And so Aaron and Cody have been sharing blue and it really isn't the best thing for his training. And it's just been really sad and hard for Aaron. And in our house, we've always had three dogs. And so we have three again. He's here, he's here, daddy's here. Who is it? Who is it? Who is it, Blue? <laughs> Who is it? That's weird. Oh, yours. <laughs> Got me a doll. No, you're dad. I'm you're dad. not grandpa. He's yours. A hundred percent of the time. Yeah, He's no, it. I don't want to. Yeah. He's Get a dog a month ago. She said no. <laughs> I 
Well, that's <laughs> it for today's video. We hope you enjoyed. If you did, hit that subscribe button, ring the bell, you'll get notification. Thumbs up and comments all help our channel to grow. With that, we hope that you are blessed. We hope you have an awesome week, and we hope to see you in the next video. Was Bye. Years this this yeah. Yeah. Well, I'm here, right? We've been reminiscing. We have so many photos. It's, it's like, like falling in love with blue all over again. It is. The puppy is like falling in love with blue all over again. Yeah.